Ladies and gentlemen, this next contest is a special submission wrestling match consisting of one 10-minute round. Our special judge for the evening is the founder of the ADCC Submission Wrestling Championships, Nelson Montero. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, let's have a big hand for Misha Sakuna. And his opponent, fighting out of the red corner, a veteran of the UFC octagon, Renato Babalu Sabra. We got Peta Pano in Sabral's corner supporting him tonight. Yes, teammates. Yes. Now, Mika, you are going to be our sultan of submission tonight. You're going to walk us through this jiu-jitsu match. How's my Portuguese accent? Am I it's great. a CSE? It's great. It's more like submission, though. Submission, submission. wrestling because no gi. Gotcha. I know these guys very well, though. Both of them, actually. Now, walk us through here. What What's going on here? Uh, Misha's going to try to work with the takedown because that's his, uh, his thing. Babalu is going to, of course, try to avoid the takedown and uh, maybe pull guard or try his jiu-jitsu game to start with. Uh, Misha's very explosive. Babalu is more a passive uh, athlete. Here you go. Misha got the takedown. Uh, remember, the first five minutes of this, there's no points. So they're going to try to submit each other on the first five minutes. Second five minutes, they're going to be very careful what they do because there's points. Very interesting to hear that. The first five minutes is definitely going to rush the pace of... of yes, they're going to try for submission. All right, uh, he tried right now for a flying on back. Uh, that's another takedown. But it's not point score yet because... You, you can definitely see that uh, Misha is trying to use power and Babalu is using finesse. Yes, he tried to get his back there. Almost a very good solid position, but Babalu escaped. Do you think that uh, under Abu Dhabi rules, it's affected that Babalu's been involved as a valley tudo or mixed martial arts fighter? Do you think it's going to affect him in Abu Dhabi rules? No, Babalu's been doing this for a long time too. He competed in this type of tournament for over 10 years. So he's, I think he got more experience than Misha, but uh, Misha's very explosive, got the youth. It's just, he's a powerful fighter. Babalu's pretty cool. He doesn't even get his hair messed up. I, I'm impressed with that. <laughs> you Brazilian guys, you're so cool, man. <laughs> Misha's working hard, though. You can see he's starting to breathe a little hard. You can see uh, maybe a little bit of the, the youth shown. He's only 20 years old. He, the kid's built like a, uh, a monster. But, again, he's trying to outpower a guy that wants him to outpower him. He wants to wear him out, correct? Yes. He's a very explosive fighter, too. got to be very smart how he fight him. Uh, Babalu uses a kind of defensive hold almost. Misha's more pressure the, the fight here to get the takedown, of course. And where's Babalu from in uh, Brazil? He's from Rio de Janeiro, Brazil. Uh, he used to be a Luta Livre guy. Oh, now it's a good takedown, actually. Yes, very good. And uh, he moved to Jiu-Jitsu a few years ago to Barra Grace team, which I think was at the smartest uh, decision they haven't made because made him a better fighter. Yes, yes. Now he's, he's going to try to uh, fix the position here to maybe attack the neck or the arm. What should Misha do to stop Babalu from taking his back? He got to roll here so he doesn't get his back. Roll or try to face Babalu. I think roll might be a better option though. And of course, uh, Mark Lehman, who's uh, one of the top um, American uh, submission coaches in uh, the corner of Misha, he's really trying to push him, but uh, yes. it's hard. I don't care who's in your, in your corner, you're still fighting Babalu. <laughs> yes. He's kept very well, though. Babalu's just smooth, cold guard there. That was excellent. Mm -hmm. Now, this is what Babalu is good at triangles and bars, homoplatas, using his legs. Almost hit a submission. Yes, yes, yes. Switch for another submission. Very good uh, sequence here of uh, moves back to the triangle. He's being very smart. He's putting move after move. Is that the Kimura is going now for? Now go for Omoplata, which Omoplata. is a shoulder lock. Uh, yes. He's a, he have a good move. He might be able to finish him here, actually. He's just uh, effortlessly. He escapes. He escapes He's effortlessly, well. though, submission attempts from Babalu. Yes, very good. He got another 
triangle attempt right here on the top. Actually, excellent position. You can tell that Misha's a little bit out of his environment here on the ground. Absolutely. And yeah. he might get finished right here. Taking him into the Bermuda Triangle, possibly. Oh, oh, Getting I him think lost. this is over. This might be over. This is over. He got him. Very game attempt by Misha, but you can just see the experience, the expertise, and just so yes. cool by Babalu, man. Just very a cool calm, game. very uh, thinking game here. What do you guys call cool in Portuguese? Uh, frio. Frio, just yeah. chilled, man. Yeah. Here's the replay. Walk us through it here. Uh, Misha go for the takedown. Babalu tried to lock a guillotine. He, of course, take him down hard. He pushes the arm here and starts to go for triangles, I think. Yes, that's what he's going to do here. He's pushing the arm, going for triangle. He's going to switch from Oplata. And uh, I think it's more the experience, the technique against a little bit more power. Misha forces the power, Babalu uh, technique. Man. And again, thank you.